Hello YouTube, this is Ryan back again from the Student Arts Network. Today I'm very excited to bring you with me with a special video of going to the 10th Annual Pre-Pharmacy Day hosted by Pre-Pharmacy Society at UCI. Um, I'll just bring you along and you can get to see what's going on. Let's go. I think 
Choose which to pursue while in pharmacy school. Mm -hmm. So prior to this, I felt like Dr. Franson kind of felt that I was nervous, so she came and talked to me. She's like, you know, you don't have to be nervous. It's really nothing is set in stone. And so, in terms of choosing right the right area for you, I feel like that just comes with time. There's really no pressure at all when it comes to pursuing pharmacy, pursuing, I guess, just getting through that process of making sure that pharmacy is right for you and choosing the right school. I know it seems like that's kind of what your role is right now, and just you're scared to make the wrong decision, but there really isn't a wrong decision. Mm -hmm. Thank 
you. Thank you, Tiffany, for that introduction. And I think, Juliana, your presentation right before was a really great thing. Hello, it's Ryan here. Um, this is half time right now, half intermission. I've so far enjoyed it a lot. You know, getting to go through all the workshops and getting to even have, uh, you know, just having this diversity of guest speakers today. It's truly, I think, amazing and get really refreshing. And I'm continuing looking forward to the next two workshops or Dean panel.
So Zena, what is Pre-Pharmacy Day? Pre-Pharmacy Day is an all-day event that is located here at UCI Student Center in which we have the opportunity to invite a wide variety of a multitude of schools from all over the country. And in PPD, the main goal is to have all students be able to interact with representatives and learn more about the pharmacy career path. And in this way, students are able to mingle and network with a, a lot of representatives here. Uh, so being the ambassador, how have you enjoyed planning this year's PPD? So one thing different about our 10th annual PPD is that we are actually inviting PPS at UCI alumni to come and have workshops. So it was a really great opportunity for me to reach out to all of these alumni that have once been a part of pre-pharmacy society here at UC Irvine and have them come in and present. And it was really nice networking with a lot of different representatives as well. So for the audience out there, do you have anything you want to talk about about what PPS has done recently and anything else you want to speak about? Yeah, so Pre-Pharmacy Society is a great organization for individuals to really put yourself out there. It's a great way for everyone to be able to learn professional as well as interpersonal skills. If you're unsure about the uh, pharmacy career field or are even thinking about it slightly, it's a really great opportunity to be able to learn more and have the ability to network and be with such amazing individuals. So, Hedy, what does the 10th Annual Pre-Pharmacy Day mean to UCI? I'm going to approach it in, in a couple perspectives. The first one is what does it mean to um, our student leaders in pre-pharmacy society? It is a major accomplishment um, for them to have such a well-organized student organization to put in the effort to have this event continue because this, this event is a result. The 10th annual is a result of their efforts. Um, of putting in their time and energy and motivation and passion into really a celebration of the pharmacy profession. And, and then in terms of for, um, for myself, I'm just really, really emotionally excited and happy because it is very rewarding for me to see student success, to be to be a resource to them, to encourage them, to work with them through this process. And so to see that there are many students who were in PPS or who came to Pre-Pharmacy Day and are now successful student pharmacists and successful pharmacists because it's been 10 years. And so we have many students who went through uh, Pre-Pharmacy Day and that are now full-fledged practicing pharmacists. And then in terms of, of UC Irvine, I'm just, I think it's, it's, just, um, it's just wonderful that we have um, the support of our community as well as um, um, uh, pharmacy and colleges and American Association of College of Pharmacy to be supportive and being here and committed um, to coming to this event uh, for the ones that participate to, to, to show to prospective students that we are here, we want to support your journey, we want you to get to know our programs, and we want you to get to know us. And so, <laughs> so that's what it means in my perspective. <laughs> yes. So having the last two years of PPD online, now transitioning back to in-person, what has been the biggest positive this year? I think the biggest positive for a lot of us is that it's just to be together and to be in person. Um, PPD was founded in an, as an in-person event and you really have a great opportunity at this event to build, to network and to build relationships. Um, I'm so thrilled to see my external colleagues from other uh, pharmacy schools and colleges. I'm so thrilled to see um, uh, Ms. Libby Ross from AACP here. And I'm, most importantly, I'm so thrilled to see students on campus at this event engaging with each other as well as representatives. So I think that is the biggest positive that I have.
Say hi to Cameron. I'm on. <laughs> So that's it for the 10th annual Pre-Pharmacy Day. I hope you enjoyed the video. Drop a like, share, and subscribe to the channel. And I hope to see you in the next video. Thank you. Bye-bye.